<laughs> come down, come down. <laughs> come here. Have a seat. You know what, Effie? I'm going to tell you a story. It is a tale about knights, wicked creatures, hope, redemption, and above all, magic. A long time ago, so long ago that I can barely remember, there was a young man called Ganon, who had been gifted with great strength. One day, a girl knocked on his door asking for help, as her cart had broken down in the nearby forest. Ganon, however, was extremely lazy, so he lied to her and told her there was nothing he could do about it. No, not now. The young girl, however, was a powerful witch, and she cursed <laughs> Gallon, who instantly turned into an old man. You don't know what you've got until it's gone, right? Gallon didn't know what to do, as he had never witnessed magic before. So he decided to visit the master who lived at the top of the mountain. Perhaps he could undo the spell. <laughs> but to his disappointment, though, the master was unable to do it. Hmm. However, the master also told him that the elder protectors, ancient ancestors who watched over kind-hearted souls, possessed the power to break the enchantment. Galland was unsure whether he had a kind heart or not, but what were his options? He traveled relentlessly for days until he finally reached the Temple of the Elder Protectors. There he was. And suddenly, the ground trembled beneath his feet. Nature was taking over the very corridor. He had to run for his life! Roots shot up from the very ground itself, and Galland was forced to take a leap of faith. And he succeeded! He could hardly believe his luck, but now he had to just climb up. He had taken a hit and a tumble, but he survived the fall. This was the beginning of his magical adventure. The rune stones apparently strengthened Galland. They endowed him with vitality, power, and even wisdom. It was like a taste of youth. was not on Galen's side. He had to find the Elder Protectors before it was too late. The temple had to be brimming with secrets, left behind by its old constructors.
Gallen felt much better now. Those were the statues of the Elder Protectors. Gallant had to reach the center of the hall. But how? Our hero tread upon a strange tile on the floor, and it activated a mechanism in the door. Gallen felt much better now. 